Good morning, Summit Seeker here with a couple products to review for you this morning. As I look to the 2024 backpacking season, I realized that I had uh, a piece of gear that I needed to re replace and then another piece of gear that I wanted to upgrade to better meet my needs. So let's jump right into the uh, product review. I'm a big fan of air pumps. I love them for inflating uh, sleeping pad air mattresses in my Neo Air air pump died last year and so I've seen a lot of reviews on this Flextail Zero Pump and so I bought one and uh, so far I'm impressed. Um, I'm going to tell you the reasons why I like it. If you want to know all the particulars about it, go to their website and check out their specifications to learn all about that. Uh, the thing I like about it is small. Uh, small and lightweight. I think with the uh, with the attachment, it comes in at, at 2.1 ounces. Um, it's made of solid material. You, you put this in your hand, you just it feels like it's quality. It comes with six or so of these uh, rubber adapters that fit snugly, not only onto the uh, pump, but also I've got the the adapter here for the. A wing nut on my Neo Air and it fits snugly on that as I'll show you in a minute. Um, we like to do trips into the Grand Canyon where I bring a pack raft and it has an adapter that fits my Mat Cat pack, mat, pack raft beautifully so um, I'm really looking forward to using this item. The other thing I, I like about this is it has a rechargeable battery, a USB-C rechargeable battery I'm tired of being in the back country where the batteries in my headlamp uh, go dead or in this case last year batteries in my in my air pump died as well and I had no way to recharge them so I was just without those devices uh, on that trip so I'm, I'm replacing items that uh, have have uh, the capability of recharging in the back country so this can be recharged which leads me to my second product review and that's the Nightcore Carbo 20,000 milliamp power bank. It's a little more expensive than other 20,000 milliamp power banks, but for a good cause. Um, as you can see, it's it's small, it's compact, it's a little bit bigger than a deck of cards. Um, it weighs, they say, about 36% less than other comparable 20,000 milliamp uh, power banks. Um, it comes in at about 11.2 ounces. Um, my 10,000 milliamp Anker power bank came in at like 6.7 ounces. So for about four, ounce, four plus ounces more, I got twice as much power. This should power my iPhone 11 five plus times. And then if I need to recharge my air pump or my headlamp, I've got more than enough power to take care of those needs. Um, it also has a USB and USB-C input output and a cord to, to help you with the recharging. So those are my two new items that I'm excited to, to give a try this season. And now let's look at how the Flextail pumps up my air mattress and, and my pack raft. It'll give you a flavor for how noisy it might be and how quickly it can pump up, uh, pump up those items. So. Let's give that a shot. To start it, push the on button twice. I'll be timing it to see how long it takes to inflate my Neo Air uh, 25 inch wide air mattress. Just under one minute to inflate that.
a little over three and a half minutes to inflate that. That's awesome. Okay, the uh, Flextail Air Pump uh, Zero Pump has efficiently and uh, relatively quietly inflated both my air mattress and my pack raft. Typically, uh, it takes 20 plus minutes to inflate the pack raft by mouth. So this air pump uh, saves you time and energy. Uh, money well spent in my opinion. So there's my review on both the uh, Flextail Zero Pump and the Nightcore Carbo 20,000 milliamp. I hope you enjoyed the review. For those of you wondering what I'm drinking here, it is uh, carrot and beet juice along with some lemon, apple, turmeric, ginger, and coconut water. To your health and happy trails to you.